So welcome to a quick tutorial on how to get your 3D geometry inside of Element 3D from Video Copilot. Overall, I'm just going to show you kind of the principles on how you need to get your stuff into Element 3D and be ready to just use it right out the gate without any problems. So we're going to keep it simple and just start with a basic cube inside of Cinema. So you go up here click on cube and so they just give you this basic parametric cube so first thing you want to do is take this cube convert it into a polygon because element will not read it if it's anything other than polys so I turn it into a polygon you can see my icon changed over here and then I'm gonna switch to surface all right, so when you get inside of Element, you're going to want to be able to change your materials and just have control over whatever you want to have control over. So let's say I wanted to animate these faces or even just have them all be different textures. I need to let Element know that I want these to be different. And so this is how you end up creating that kind of control inside of Element. You go inside Create hit new material and you get a new material you're not even worried about making it pretty at this point you're just gonna select the surface drag and drop the material on there and make sure you stay organized so you name the material so we'll just call this one number one and so when you open up element you'll see one pop up so you're just gonna just keep doing that create another material I'm going to name this one 2 and I'm going to map it to this part of the cube create another material and let's say I wanted this one to control several sides of it click on so you can see I've selected the top the back and the bottom. I'm just going to drag and drop that material on there. I'm going to name it number three. And then I just have one side left, and we can make that material number four. Up, oh, got to select it first. And drop material number four on there. Make sure it's named four. And all this will save you time inside of Element, making sure that you named them. Alright, so we've taken a look at all the materials in here. So our cube is now labeled and everything has a material on it. And so from here you just make sure you save it. So I'm just going to name it Cube Cinema 4D. Just leave it as extension C4D because I think since version 2 of Element 3D, you've been able to just import Cinema 4D files native. I recommend leaving them that way instead of exporting as an OBJ because you get it's just a lot easier to work back and forth between Cinema and Element that way. So then you just hit save. And now we just switch over to After Effects. So I'm going to hide that. And I'm running After Effects 2019 here. I already got a comp ready. This is just a standard HD comp. So I'm going to go layer, new, and I'm going to do a new solid. And this is going to be my element layer. As you can see, it's HD resolution. And then I'll go down to Video Copilot under Effects and hit Element. And under scene setup, we are going to click this little arrow here to import a 3D object and navigate to where we saved our cube Cinema 4D and import. All right, so now we have our cube inside of element and if we come here and click down on the cube 
one two three four all our materials made it which means with these being sectioned out like this we can animate these different parts individually if we want and i can also come down here under the materials and just start switching them out with some of the cool shaders that we have inside of element and it's pretty much that simple and so now you're ready to play around an element from cinema and let's see let's bring in a new camera hit C to move it around and there you go you now just brought in your geometry from Cinema 4D into Element 3D and now you're just ready to go inside of After Effects alright thanks for watching my tutorial like subscribe and I'll be cranking out these quick tutorials like all the time now so I have nothing better to do in my life if you have any questions, leave a comment below. I'll make sure to check it, answer it later.